Welcome everybody. We will know today how to get XAMPP environment installed on Windows 8.1 Professional Edition with VMware Workstation or VMware Player on board. XAMPP, as we already know, gives you the ability to make your own local host server that deals with CMS programs such as WordPress, Joomla, and other CMS services. It will also install Apache, PHP MyAdmin, and PHP language support and other utilities. Some compatibility issues might rise up for Windows 8 users and here's how to deal with them. Firstly, we're gonna navigate to apachefriends.org which is the official website for XAM. and here is the description about XAM itself and again the URL is uh, apachefriends.org and down there you will find the exe installation file download link click on it and I already downloaded it and if you saw then just click on it and wait a little bit this is a message with antivirus suggestions click yes another message with user account control interfering which we will solve later click OK and next you better to leave all the components selected to be installed and click next you also better to leave the installation folder as it is and click next uncheck this option and click next next and you will have to wait now until the installation is finished Some processes might appear on the taskbar maybe once or twice. Just like that one down there. This is all about the installation purpose and none of your business. As you can see the installation is almost done. It is done now. Now keep this option checked so it runs the XAMPP as, as it finishes. This is the XAMPP control panel and all the components are ready to get started. MySQL admin is starting with no problems but the Apache server is not starting. Uh, it creates the local host. If you don't solve this problem, this issue will not let you to use the local host. And the whole XAMPP will be useless. Go back to XAMPP and scroll a little bit up to figure out that the 443 port is already used by VMware Workstation. To solve this right away from here click on configure and then select HTTPS SL configure. Try to replace any 443 string with a random number and in my case I used 4215. Find them all and replace them. Close and save, and it's done. Run the batchy. It's running as you can see. Now, the Windows 8.1 issue is about these checkboxes here which let you to run each component as a service they don't appear we can't deal with them to solve this close the exam completely and go to start menu and look for the exam control panel shortcut right click on it and click open file location right click on it again and click on troubleshooting compatibility wait a little bit then click on troubleshooting program select the uh, program requires additional permissions uh, here you can see the UAC is a problem click on test the program you can see the problem is solved but they are not responding because they are already running stop them and recheck to let them work as services start start the SQL again and it is done. 
Return to the troubleshooting and close to the fix wizard to apply the changes. And now you can enjoy using your XM side by side with VMware player and workstation with no issues. Uh, thanks for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe. 7SIBALI.net. Goodbye.